goes. Look, it's exciting. We never go live on Sunday mornings, but we're following up yesterday's live stream with another one, another breakfast with Bobby in the new kitchen. The camera's not on the tripod today. You'll see the most beautiful camera lady you'll ever see in a minute. Uh, but welcome, welcome to Pompano Beach, Florida. We're gonna make breakfast burritos. Uh, we've made burritos before a while back, but they were dinner burritos and they were- No sound. What? No, we should, we should, there should be sound. Uh, but they weren't perfect. I perfected the recipe later on and then uh, it worked out really well. No, Jen, turn on your volume. It wasn't on Jen. Um, so Pompano Beach is right below Boca Raton. Uh, we're building a home we showed you yesterday on Instagram in Boca, renting a house in Pompano. Uh, Desi, say hello to everyone. Hi, guys. And Rose, say hi to everyone. Hello. Uh, breakfast with Bobby. Yesterday we made the uh, pancake breakfast. Today we're making burritos. And uh, breakfast with Bobby today is sponsored by Thrive Market, right? I got a huge Thrive Market box coming roasty in the mail uh, that I ordered because we're out of so much stuff uh, because of the move. Um, if you don't know about Thrive Market, I know a lot of you guys do. Thrive Market has everything you would normally get at the grocery store, but cheaper. Per order, you save about $32 compared to going to the grocery store. And the nicest thing is the box comes to your door. Um, I've been using Thrive Market now for six years. They're the longest supporter of the channel. And we have a sweet promo code right now. I'll tell you more about it later on. But when you click the link down below, you get 25% off your entire first order and a free gift up to $31. And it's risk-free, meaning if you don't love it, which I'm pretty sure you will because I only bring you guys the best stuff, you can cancel and get your membership feedback. But Thrive has the goods. Uh, I've just put some collagen in my tea and I showed you that vitamin C powder that is best in class, that's cheaper on Thrive Market than Amazon. Look at all the birdies in the front yard, Rose. Oh my gosh. Look at all the birdies. Oh, look at that, Rose. The birdies are walking by. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we don't know the name of these birds. If yeah, someone's anyone know what from those are? Florida, let us know the name. I'm sure somebody knows. Right? We'll give you guys a little bit of a tour too, since Desi's on camera duty today. Um, so breakfast burritos are gonna have refried beans, pasture raised eggs, a little bit of salsa, avocado. We're gonna griddle the burrito and then crust it in cheese. It's probably, mm, wow. yeah, it's probably the best one you can possibly make. You ain't gonna find this one at Chipotle or Moe's or that's daddy's uh, microphone pack, sweetie. Or what's another burrito joint? Uh, Qdoba, right? Has anyone tried the uh, cauliflower rice from uh, Chipotle? I will say it's tasty, but um, it's expensive and they're very stingy. Can with $10 super chat, we come and clean your pool. Yeah, we need help with that. <laughs> well, the guy came yesterday and he said it was filthy. So now it's clean. The problem is it's it's not a heated pool. The thing is, every day there's leaves that fall down. So we need a pool boy here. <laughs> pool boy mostly for the next house too. But this pool is what? It's salt. It's salt water. There's no chlorine, but it's not heated. So this time of year, it's way too cold. I dipped my toes in there yesterday. No way, man. No way. Yeah, Ro Rose has her butter back. She does. Look, look how Rose is like working on the butter. I'm gonna need some of that butter, Rose. Yeah, with those little fingers and nails, <laughs> my Rosie. Okay, so refried beans is gonna be onions, garlic, organic black beans. We'll cook it down, we'll mash them. We'll put them back in the pan with a bunch more fat and some bone broth or some water and they get really creamy and delicious. Yeah, my sweet love. And that's it. Um, I don't have any pork fat. It didn't make the trip down and I didn't buy any yet. So Rose, I'm gonna borrow some of your butter here. Yeah, that was grandma in the background. She's back and forth in the garden. Um, she's gardening. Oh, she's doing some good for stuff. For two back days there. now, she's really enjoying it. We'll go back there and we'll show you. The backyard's great. We have the two mango trees back there. We got one more mango tree. Solar blanket. What's a solar blanket? I don't know what that is. Uh, let's just get this in the pan here. Okay, if you're just joining, welcome to Breakfast with Bobby live at 9 o'clock in the morning Eastern, 6 in the morning West Coast. Raise your hand if you woke up at 6 in the morning to hang out with us. I know my girl Renee Denham did. I saw a few more names out there. Uh, please leave comments down below. Let Rose Honey know where you're watching from. Don't you want to know? 
Yeah, you want to know. You want to know where everyone's watching from. Yuval wants to know a lamb chops recipe. Uh, always go for, to flavecity.com. All the recipes have, are there. Even better would be just to Google search it. My name plus Flav City, and Google will take you to the exact page, I think. Yeah, lamb is, chops, Flav City, you got it. Yeah, you got it. And in the cookbook, in the new cookbook, mm -hmm. the best selling cookbook is an amazing five ingredient lamb chop with green sauce. Yeah, who's that? Who's that? It's Daddy. Who's that? Mommy. Do we miss Chicago? Not yeah. at all. <laughs> Not at all, especially this time of year when it's beautiful. Yeah, look. See, there's grandma outside. Oh, there's grandma, yeah. She is started work on the patio furniture now, trying to tidy it up and get it set up nice. Grandma loves a garden, so this is perfect for her. And then this will be her dry run to make our garden in, uh, in Boca. How can I buy your cookbook? Amazon. I put the link down below. So let me show you a couple of things. Come over here, Des. So if you go here below the video, first and foremost, I got to walk around to your side, is my Thrive Market link. So this link is your money link because when you click right here, sometimes you got to hit the arrow on mobile. Try Thrive Market using my link. You get 25% off your first order and a $31 free gift. One of those gifts right now, you guys, is a bottle of Primal Kitchen Avocado Oil and Primal Ranch Dressing, and it's 30 days risk-free. Um, I wrote a list of my favorite Thrive Market stuff. Look at Rose. I'll, put, um, I'll start using that in the future, but right here, Rose, Desi. If you click my link here to Amazon, or if you're in another country, you can search Flay City on Amazon. There it is. Look at this, Desi. 2,000 mm -hmm. five-star ratings. Wow. Number one bestseller from day one. And it's wow. Old, and it's been out now. Look at this. It's number 46 on Amazon. It's been in the top 100 now for two, three weeks. Guys, there's 3 million books on Amazon. So if you have not bought the book yet, click that link, try it out. You're going to love it. And if you bought the book, please do us a uh, favor. Leave a review on, um, on Amazon. Book reviews are very important for that all elusive Amazon algorithm. But also check out Thrive Market. I actually just uh, typed a list of my favorite Thrive stuff. So going forward, uh, I'll paste that in everything I do. Well, I think I missed the super chat. It was for um, I'll go back four ninety nine. I think. Dada. Um, Dada. Lots of questions Dada. about Art. Art is not moving, but we wait for him to come visit. Yes, correct. Art is not moving, but he will definitely visit. Art's a Chicago guy. So the links below the video. You click on description, right, or something? Yeah, so all the so here's the video. If you're on mobile, sometimes there's an arrow right here, and all the links are there. Also, all my kitchen gear <laughs> is listed right there. Is this a comic book, or is it a cookbook, Rosie? Daddy. Yeah, there's Daddy right there. And there's Rosie. Look, Rosie's right there. Wow, she's eating butter and turning all the pages to the book. Okay, let's put the book over. Oh, there's butter all over the book, Rosie. Maria loves my uh, yeah. lemon cake. Oh, that's one of my favorite recipes. Yeah, Rose and I In made In the that dessert on, uh, uh, chapter, yeah. The l lemon olive oil cake is to die for. Rose and I made that on live on a Facebook video. Mama, mama, mama. A few weeks ago. Who's yeah, going to be your assistant, Bobby? Who's going to be your assistant? Yes, mom. <laughs> I'm working on it. I need one. <laughs> okay, so we'll get the refried beans going. Then we'll just scramble some eggs. And uh, that's the crux of it. But the way we cook the burrito, we wrap it, we griddle it, then we put cheese in the pan, let it melt, then put the burritos back in and it forms a crust. It's amazing. Really, really lovely. Well, shortbread cookies are the bomb. You know, I'm planning to do a variation of them for um, Valentine's Day, so stay tuned. I'm gonna make them oh, chocolate. Oh, that's right, chocolate hey, version, yeah. Dad. Yeah, there's Daddy looking at the grass-fed meat in the butcher counter. So for a family of three on a budget, yeah. would you recommend Aldi or Costco? Um, I would recommend both. Daddy, dumb, I'm <laughs> I'd recommend both. Start with Aldi because it's free. But there's so many things you can get at Costco that they don't have at Aldi. And the membership fee is, what, 60 bucks? But if you know how to shop there and buy stuff that is not going to expire very easily, it's a no-brainer, I'm telling you. And I think you can return your membership if you don't love it. Just chopping up some garlic here. And that garlic. Where can you buy a nice stainless steel frying pan? Um, 
I have everything on my Amazon shop page. So all the kitchen gear that I use is on there. Um, if you click the link below the cookbook, it's amazon.com slash shop slash Flav City. It's all Amazon products that I use and I earn like a 2% commission, it's nothing. But all the stuff is there so you guys know what to buy. Yes, Mama. My sweet love. What kind of cheese are you using? I'm going to use the Kerrygold Dubliner from Costco, actually. That's one of the 100 few. 100% grass-fed? It's 80% grass-fed. Kerrygold Dada. abides by, I, yeah, by Irish dairy law, meaning in the winter they do feed it some grain, but it's still better than almost anything at the grocery <laughs> store, and the price is unbelievable. <laughs> yeah. Yes, uh, Sabolas, we love Laird and Four Sigmatic both. Oh, yeah. They're making some Laird uh, Insta Fuel. <laughs> Hot cocoa pretty soon. Maritza, thank you so much for your answered emails. Uh, and oh, nice. Desi, thank you so much for inspiring with your Bob's Red Meal Paleo Baking Flour. I'm yeah, glad. I'm glad. I have not seen hearts of palm pasta in a can at Costco, but if it's palmini, I would skip it because they use citric acid and it makes it very acidic. It ruins it. Okay. We'll wow. Uh, Monica lost 29 pounds so far thanks to you. Wow, Monica, love it. love it. We hear so much feedback about that, but you can't help but lose weight when you're eating that kind of diet, clean eating or keto specifically, because you're getting rid of inflammatory foods. You're getting rid of food, of junk food, and you're eating a low carb, uh, low glycemic diet. It's winning all around. Oh, Rose, you're just so spreading. I ball. just saw the. Uh the chat, uh, super chat from Cheryl, four ninety nine. Much love and respect to your family. Thank you for saving my life with knowledge and recipes. Any Hold ideas on, when you will be signing cookbooks again? Uh, it's going to be a little while because actually the cookbook is just about sold out at Amazon and the publisher. Clean her hands. Give us like, uh, give us about three, four weeks. Hold on, Rosie. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. There was like a smear of Kerrygold all over the top of that thing. <laughs> okay, let's open up the beans. Beans, beans, good for your heart. The more Bobby you approved, eat, the more you... Bobby approved the app coming sometime in March. Uh, we're working really hard, you guys. Uh, there's a lot of products out there, yes. different grocery stores. So we're trying to gather all that data and have Bobby you know approve that? all the products. So that's a little time consuming. So we're working on that. It will be out soon, though. When it's out, watch out, it's going to be good. Yeah, it's going to be pretty amazing. It's just taking a lot of work and we want to make sure we do it right. Where's my uh, uh, We have a whole, our, um, Christina, our first cookbook is all about keto. The whole book is keto. Um, it has like over 100 recipes that are keto. It's called uh, Keto Meal Prep by Flav City. So check that out. In the second cookbook, Five Ingredient Meal Prep, there are some recipes that are keto, but not all of them. Yeah, everything's paleo though. Everything is paleo, yeah. In this cookbook. Okay, I got some organic black beans. The reason why you want to get organic legumes is because conventional can score high in glyphosate, which is the active ingredient in Roundup. Uh, and the reason why, because Roundup is so widely used and so prevalent now, mainly for corn and uh, soy, that it, it really infects the soil and it tends to hurt crops and infect crops like legumes, wheat, and oats. Evie said, thank you. Her and her husband lost over 10 pounds using, following you. And then Rachel Murray, $25. There she is. Good morning, family. Cooking along with you. Nice, I love my new pan making chili for dinner. Nice. Rachel's been working hard lately in the queue. But she is here. I did post the ingredients you would need for this uh, yesterday, uh, last night on the uh, community. By the way, I scheduled this live stream last night and posted the ingredients. It's probably the most prepared I've ever been. So I hope you guys check that out. Okay. So black beans are in. Bland as can be, right? So we'll go in here. We'll pinch a good amount of salt in there. And then we'll hit it up with some pepper. And then we'll just cook it for a little bit, mash it and add some bone broth or some water. And then add a little bit of lime juice at the end and we're good to go. Uh, do you suggest keto or paleo for uh, losing weight and being pre-diabetic? 
keto for sure. If you're pre-diabetic, if you need to lose weight, if your numbers are high, keto. <laughs> and once you get that under control, then you can transition over to keto paleo. That's what we do, but then even sometimes we'll have brown rice, wild rice, uh, red lentil pasta. That's not keto or paleo because legumes are not paleo, but it's still part of our clean eating lifestyle. And Cami for Parkland, can't wait to run into us in Costco or Trader Joe's. So this is a new thing I think Bobby's gonna be doing here in Florida. Uh, I think a couple hours before his holds. Yes. He's gonna announce on Instagram where he's going. So mm -hmm. if you wanna join him, yep. just, just go to that store somewhere here in the Fort Lauderdale, Miami area, yep. and he'll be there. Absolutely. So uh, it's more check fun. that out on Instagram, yeah. It's more fun that way. Yes, sweetheart. West Palm Beach. Oh, we love West Palm Beach. Yeah. What made you decide to move to Florida? Boca specifically, $5 from KMA Gura. Uh, just a change of scenery. Got tired of the cold weather. Uh, we have friends down here too, like Erica, and there's no taxes here. It was really a no brainer. I mean, it's January. It's beautiful. Rose is running around barefoot outside. It's great. So, refried beans. Hi, Viviana. Beans. Viviana's Viviana. in the house. Refried beans are underway. Uh, check out the tortillas I got here. Where are the ingredients for this breakfast? It's posted on the description box down below. All the in information is always in the description box down below. So these are the paleo best in class burrito wrappers. If you're gonna get a wheat burrito, I highly recommend organic because wheat can score high in glycosate. Uh, so you gotta get organic. Uh, we get the cheese out here and Desi's favorite sour cream, the dairy-free forager one, made of cashews. We got France, London, all over the world, India, oh my God, Hong yes. Kong. Amazing. France, India, Hong Kong, wow. Keep leaving comments down below. Let us know where you're watching from. Um, then I need some salsa. I just bought, ooh, Whole Foods has a good sale right now. My favorite, Frontera, double roasted salsa. And it's a really good deal. It's actually cheaper than any other store, inclu including Aldi right now. Is the cheese dairy free? Well, so this no. cheese, the, <clears throat> the one we're gonna shred ooh. and griddle the burrito in is not dairy free, but this forager sour cream is dairy free. Yes. But keep in mind, aged cheeses like this have no lactose. If I use sour cream from dairy, it would have lactose, and that'd be too much dairy for us to handle. India, Gentle? Pennsylvania, Gentle. Montreal. All right, why don't you and I got a couple minutes here. Why don't you guys go in the backyard, yeah. maybe? Let's go together yeah. in the backyard and see where Baba done. Maybe don't go too far because I don't have the outdoor uh, thing there. The Wi-Fi. Oh, yeah, sure. Let's show everybody around. I'll stay in the kitchen here. Okay, so here's the pool, you guys. Hmm? Yeah, and Baba is here. Yes? Baba is here. Uh, all right, so here's the pool. The water is actually very cold because the pool is not heated, so we haven't gotten in it yet. Because, um, I mean, technically it's, it is winter here, so the water is a little cool. And I want to show you where my mom has started planting some... Yeah. Um, some in the backyard she's got oh, a lot of seeds signal. planted and then um, we'll go over on the other side and I'll show you these two trees here are mango trees they're huge oh, yeah. we have so many can you imagine trees how again? many mangoes we're gonna have thousands thousands and thousands of mangoes so bring your shopping bag here and grab some mangoes if you're around. And uh, yeah, some more things planted here, some dill, some mint, uh, some more seeds over here. Um, a little bit of, yeah, I think I these are peppers. Love it. And my mom always plants. I went too far, sorry guys. That's okay, it was just out for like a second. Yeah, I, I went too far, all right. No, no, so you're good. here's a nice view of the pool. Yeah, Rose, that Baba Dani is using this for uh, watering the plants. For sure, my man. Thank you so much. So, this is it. All right, and then we have this little window here where Bobby popped in through. <laughs> this is my pass through, right? Order up, we got a burrito. Rose, honey, got a burrito? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Look at Rose. Order up, burrito and fries. All right, we got four ninety nine. dollars Yeah, I just got that one from uh, Bro. Okay, hi, Bobby and Desi. Yeah. Hi, guys. 
and then show the view from the front, babe. So if you come okay, over Rose, here. Rose, come with me. Let's go inside. Let's go inside. Oh, no, no, no. Baba Dan is working on these things. Uh oh, let's not touch. Let's not touch, Rosie. Okay. Baba is planting these things. Let's see. Mommy, you're supposed to take out the net. Drada Magnesh. Ah, okay, okay. No, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna plant some tomatoes. Oh, these are Bulgarian uh, heirloom tomatoes. All right, Rose. Yeah, let's not touch my love. Least three, four, let's go five inside. Months. She'll go back eventually, but it's a one-way right. ticket. One Might have to get her, morning. babe, because she. Uh, or right, mama, is she doing glitters the mouth? Glitter Rose. And my mom's gonna watch. Her. Okay. Cool. Welcome back. She really wants to play with the seedling uh, pods there. Okay. And that's nice if you just look. So come from my perspective here. You can <laughs> see all the palm trees here. The crane yeah, walk I mean, by. Don't, uh, yeah, here you go, you guys. Yeah, yeah lots, of, uh, lots of stuff Fair to see around. Yeah, we, we, I mean, it's just beautiful here. Absolutely beautiful. All right, come in here. It's okay, Rose. Come on. Do not miss, uh, do not miss Chicago one bit. It's okay. Come on, I come on. I can tell you come that. On. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Woo! Yeah, you got to be on the YouTube, right? <laughs> you don't want to feel left out. <laughs> All right. That's a little bit of the house. Now, once we get it more set up, I'll do a... Uh, a proper like tour on Instagram. Oh yeah, Art did a, an amazing uh, French onion yeah, soup. Yeah, I heard about that. Uh, yes, the tortillas are at Whole Foods, the Siete, and they have really good uh, organic wheat ones too from uh, Maria and Ricardo and from uh, La Tortilla Factory. All right, guys, Sunday morning, it's 9.25 Eastern, 6.25 on the West Coast. Breakfast with Bobby. Burritos are underway. They're gonna be absolutely epic. They're uh, gluten-free. They're absolutely uh, great. They're paleo too, if you didn't use the uh, real cheese. Um, super easy. Uh, please leave comments down below. Continue to let us know where you're watching from. Uh, we got Thrive Market as the sponsor of this stream. They sponsor at least one stream every single week. Check them out using my code down below in the description box. You get the hookup with 25% off your first order and a free gift. And I talked about it yesterday, but this one, Desi. This vitamin C powder is a must during the winter. It's the most bioavailable one I know on the market because it's made from acerola and kamu kamu and amla, not from ascorbic acid. If your vitamin C is made from ascorbic acid, it's crud, it's bad. Mm. Get this along with vitamin D and vitamin uh, zinc on Thrive Market. Those three are the immune system boosters. The $10 savings compared to Amazon just for this alone is worth it. Using my code down below. And uh, that's it. If you want to check out the cookbook we were talking about earlier, the link's down there too, or just search Flav City on Amazon. Uh, but let's hang out. Let's continue to make some burritos and do our thing. Uh, someone's saying they heard there's a 10 inch snow coming to Chicago. No. <laughs> Are you serious? Uh -uh. 10 inch would be crazy. Okay, um, I'm gonna scramble the eggs now. Yeah, so just so you know, guys, this is just a rental house here. We're renting it for 10 months until our home gets uh, ready. And yes, we're gonna have a pool in the new home and it's gonna be heated. Hey, Rosie. So that we can use it all the time. Yes. We want it to be down in Florida while the construction is happening, but also come even earlier. That way we don't have to be in Chicago in the winter. And uh, it was a no brainer. It's so nice. And this time of year in Florida is great because the mornings and evenings are cool. But right around now and the rest of the day, it warms up to about 75, 80. It's beautiful. All right, check out what's going on here, Desco. The beans, the onions. Oh, I got to put my spices in there real quick. Hold on. Spices. A little bit of smoked paprika if I can find it. I'm going to go to this place you guys told me about yesterday, the Spice Lab. Where is your code? Uh, it's in the description box, thrivemarket.com slash Bobby, right here, Memo. Yeah, here, here's the video and there's a description box below it. Just click it, it's not open. So you yeah. have to click. Right there. Click on the... There's usually an arrow here it's on an, mobile. It's an arrow here, so you want to click on that Cookbook, and it's going to expand the, market, all that. the description box. Yeah. Can I have that, Rosie? Thank you. Can I have? <laughs> Can I have? Thank you. I'm out of cumin, but I'm going to go... 
to that yes, place. Yes, we need a higher counter. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. No, it's not bad for a rental. Don't get me wrong. It's just, yeah, I mean, this is the thing is people from Florida will tell you. It's really hard to find. Yeah, a little bit of term. You want to do some a salt? A short term here? rental with a nice kitchen. Okay. It's just pretty much impossible. Give daddy a pinch of salt. And also, um, mm -hmm. there, it's very rare Thank to you. find a guest cooktop in Florida. So we were lucky to find this one um, in this house. So when we saw that with the counter for, a good, for that was nice for presentation, we, spilled it yesterday. We, just, That's good. we just went for it because it's just really hard to uh, find any decent rentals. Yeah. It's only because the owner of the house uh, owns a restaurant too. And uh, that's why he put the, uh, maybe the previous guy put a gas cooktop in here. Because I can't cook on electric. And almost everything in Chicago, in, uh, Chicago, in uh, Florida is electric. It's electric. Dun, 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 dun. So now I'm going to mash it and then we'll refry it in more butter. And I think I'll add some bone broth too. So you're using like several different pans. Can you uh, show what kind of pans you're using? Yes, yeah, so I'm using stainless steel for the beans because I don't want to scratch my uh, nonstick ceramic. I'm using a giant cast iron just to warm the tortillas. The burrito wrappers are huge and you have to do it in a pan or a comal. And then I'm doing the eggs here in a nonstick ceramic. Mm -hmm. So. I want the beans really creamy, babe, and mashed. You got it. Well, I'm going to start it now, and then it'll be easier to mash once I add some more liquid. I think the thing is really hot. Mm -hmm. The hot burner. So, so this burner's going to run really hot. So hot. As you can tell by the pancakes, they got a little scorched. scorched Whoa, a lot first. of noise, babe. Wow. <laughs> All right. So refry, we need more fat. Normally, I would add pork fat right now, but I'm out of the epic pasture-raised pork fat, so I'm going to add a bunch of butter. Butter, Rosie. Huh? Did Where'd you find the large ceramic uh, pan from? Um, this one's from Stobe. Oh, the ceramic pan is from uh, my Amazon shop page. It's from Zwilling. So when you click the link down below for my Amazon shop page, it's on there. But you know what I recently decided, you guys? I'm going to get one non-stick pan, uh, a good quality one, either from Zwilling or Tramantina, because certain things like the, the delicate pancakes, the keto pancakes we did yesterday, and crepes and whatnot, you just can't do it in ceramic. It's very difficult. And when you cook something like a pancake like that or a crepe, it's a very low heat. And I'm not going to use any utensils that would scratch the Teflon. So I'm okay with that in that case. I just can't do those in ceramic. It's very difficult. And I almost ruined my pancakes yesterday. So I'm going to do that and I'll tell you which one I get. Okay, there we go. So now we'll put the liquid in here. So oh, we'll oh, let wow. this get nice and swussy and it's going to cook down and get really, really delicious. This is the rental house, you, you guys. People are excited. Is this the new house? Uh, this is the rental house just for uh, temporary. Now, do you want to see what the permanent house looks like? Go to Flav City Instagram or Flay City Facebook story, and you'll see it. It's basically a concrete uh, slab right now. Careful with the scissors, Foundation. Rose. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Why don't you use electric stove top? Oh, uh, because electric is very difficult to control the heat. It, it gets really, really hot, and then if you want to turn it down, there's a delay, it's slow. It's just very difficult to cook on this. Okay. I'm gonna make some scrambled eggs. I have some pasture raised eggs here. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna whisk it for, for daddy? Yes. The, uh, is it the propane? Yeah, it's a propane tank yeah, that's outside. One. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So someone said, if you have propane, it will burn hotter than natural gas. Ah. Oh, that's the difference. Yeah, there's a propane tank on the side of the house. That's a great point. I never thought about that. The new house won't be propane. No. Yeah, because here in, in Florida, because there's no um, well, that's a really infrastructure like that, you have to make your own in your, you have to like set up your own in the house. Yeah, didn't think about that, yeah. Uh, the condo in Chicago will go on the market probably in about 10 days. We had a realtor check it out the other day. We had it clean for four hours. Do you know any Arab food? Arab? Arab food. 
Um, I love Arabic food. Desi and I really enjoy the flavors. And yeah, and we uh, and and we and we do make uh, different things like lamb chops, keftas. Yeah. Um, we we have some recipes in the uh, old cookbook and the new one as well. True. And on the website. Okay, I think you guys need to see how beautiful Desi is. Why don't you come in, babe, and do the eggs for me? All right, we'll switch with uh, Dad, huh? We'll you switch, switch with Dad. microphones too? Well, if you want to. Yeah, let's do that. So, huh, let's do that. Well, I guess who's going to hold her? <laughs> Don't worry, I can multitask. My transmitter is looking good. Hold that for a second, my dear. So how do you want me to do that? the eggs, babe? Scrambled. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hold that yeah. for a second. Here, Dad. I'll, I'll go with you, Mish. I'll go with you. Hold on. Right. the eggs. You guys are going to do eggs. Desi looks like the picture of South Florida. You guys got to see. Okay, so here. My daddy's going to adjust this for me. This one. How do you Say want to... Uh, hello, everybody. Do you want to put this hello, like right everybody. here? Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. I got to get your back, then. Hold on. I got to put this in your back. <laughs> Woo. Orientation. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Don't mess around with that. Orientation. Okay. All right. Hold on. Get. Okay. Okay, come with me. There she is. Oh, Rose Hunty. Yeah. Desi's going to take over. I'm going to take a load off here. I'm boiling my kettle there. All right. What's that kettle for, babe? Insta fuel. Oh. Insta fuel I can make that. mocha latte. I need you to do that and throw the eggs in. The eggs are in there. All right, we got to do the eggs, Frusha. Yeah. You already mixed them, right? Ah, uh, yeah, they're all whisked and everything. They're yeah, ready. Let's just all right, everyone in. say hi to the lovely Desi. So we got hi, the guys. ceramic pan with a good knob of Kerrygold there. Put that in. Here the eggs, Mish? I don't need like super smooth scrambled eggs, but not chunky monkey. Yeah, can I give you a few blueberries? Look. Blueberries. Anthony, $5 holler. Thank you uh -huh. so much. Yeah, I'll show you the exact ingredients. It's two. It's Insta Fuel and uh, hot cocoa uh, with mushrooms from uh, Insta Fuel. And I do about just under a quarter cup each. So, the technique for scrambled eggs you want to uh, low heat and, and mix constantly so that uh, no, big, no big curds are formed. Like that. But it's okay. I don't mind it today because it's going to go inside of a right. burrito. Yesterday we did the really silky scrambled eggs with the pancakes. You put all the blueberries on the floor, Rose? Oh, oh, Rosie. Chris Hunter, $2. Oh, did you move into a new house? Uh, this is the rental house. Yes, it's a house in Florida. You okay? You okay? It's a house in Florida that we're renting for 10 months. Don't throw away those blueberries. They were expensive. <laughs> And then our new house will be ready in October. Um, you know what's an amazing dairy-free cheese? This cream cheese from Kite Hill. The Garden Veggie is amazing. All of them are great, but this Garden Veggie is new. It's unbelievable. Oh my gosh, so tasty. I see a super chat here from Helen. Love you guys. Can you please wish my friend Lexi? Lexi, happy birthday from me, Desi and Rose. Thank you for that super chat, Helen. We got to go back to the pan here. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Desi abandoned my pan oh my here. <laughs> Sorry. I was just telling you how you have to cook constantly <laughs> and then I walked away. Luckily, the heat's on low. That's a great point. Whoever mentioned the propane thing, that's why these burners run so hot. It's insane. Literally insane, mm -hmm. the membrane. Mm -hmm. All right, so finish these eggs, babe, and then we can make the coffee. Oh. Can I give you something? Rose, do you want some, uh, you do you want some muala milk? Do you want some banana milk? Banana milk? No? Give her some, I don't know. Something. And then also stir those uh, refried beans. Rose, how about some banana milk? Do you want some? Banana. Yeah, it's an animal there, see? Okay. That's a koala. <laughs> yeah, where's your cup? Here it is. Here. Let's get that muala. They had this at the Whole Foods here. They didn't have it in Chicago. Get the original one. This is really cool because it's banana, sunflower seed butter, 
and or sunflower seeds and cinnamon. There's only one emulsifier in here. It's really, really good stuff. There you go, roast. Roasty approved. Stir uh, this guy up. I've seen the spirits for yeah. five minutes. Not even five minutes, it'll hold her over. And then this afternoon, we're gonna go to the beach, I think, and relax, get some sun. Okay. There we go, we're back here. All right, you guys, breakfast burritos are getting close to being done here. We got the refried beans frying away. D Slav is doing the uh, eggs over there. We got the cheese. We got the burritos from Siete. Why are these so good? Because there's no wheat. They're gluten-free and they're made with cassava flour, avocado oil, coconut flour. Amazing ingredients here, right? Not low carb because there's starch in there, but grain-free and paleo. Really, really tasty. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, Rose. Wow, almost 2,000 people questions. watching. Ask Desi anything. Hashtag ask Desi anything right now. We got 2,000 people watching right now. How exciting. I can't contain 2, my... 2,000? Wow, yeah. you guys. Uh, the tortillas are uh, $9 for six. They're not cheap, but they're really good. Inball says, Desi, you look gorgeous. Thank you, guys. I'm uh, trying to match the colorful atmosphere here in Florida. Nice. Dan says he's been using Thrive Market since October and he loves it, loves the live streams. Thank you, Dan the Man, Milwaukee Brewer. Can you re recommend any beans for beans uh, and grass-fed weenies? Can you recommend any beans for beans and grass-fed weenies? I think organic red kidney beans would be really good for that, Milwaukee Brewer. Absolutely. Uh, and once again, I will put together a list of the stuff I get on Thrive Market all the time, but I put a scoop of this in my tea or coffee every single day. It's grass-fed, unflavored collagen peptides. The price is the same as Costco when Costco doesn't have a sale. And Donnie out there working in the garden. And uh, the vitamin C combined with the D3 and the zinc, which Rose broke the bottle yesterday, but these three are the immune system boosters. But we get coconut oil, we get the Thrive Market ghee, which is why I implore you, we love Thrive Market. Let's show them some support. Try it out because the promo link in January is amazing. A free gift, the free gift right now, by the way, is a bottle of avocado oil and dressing from uh, Primal Kitchen and 25% off your first order. Also down here is the cookbook link, the kitchen gear, and all the ingredients you need to make this for afterwards. If you want to make it, here's the ingredients right down yonder. Okay, eggs are done. Eggs are done. Yeah, just take it off the heat and leave it there. I did, yeah. Perfect. That's great. So now here I'm going to make the... Ah, Insta-Fuel. Insta fuel. So... Okay, quarter cup, right? Uh, just under a quarter cup. I'd say a little less. It's going to be very strong otherwise. So we're making an Insta-Fuel Cafe Mocha. You guys oh. know I love Laird. Uh-huh. Insta-Fuel is the most premium instant coffee latte on the market. It's awesome. Arabica beans with coconut milk, coconut oil, and aquamin. This is fantastic. But when you cut it with their hot cocoa, which is cacao mixed with coconut sugar and reishi mushrooms, then you get a cafe mocha. Okay. Yeah, it's great. All right, then a little bit. Perfect for a cold winter day here, right? Eggs, I'll give you. Shush, I'll give you. Yeah, eggs are almost plate. ready. Where's her little plate? It was over there. Uh, I put it here. Oh, right here. Yeah. And let me give you some eggs. It's nice. Because sometimes Rose will go in the backyard. Sometimes we'll just open the door here and she can run outside here. And like the palm trees are right here. I'm going to grab one of those coconuts and try to open it. Does anyone think there's water in those green coconuts? See right there? Does anyone think there's water in those? Would you ever use emulsion blender to make beans smoother? Um, yeah, you could. You could. I mean, if you wanted to make one more step and make a thing dirtier, absolutely. Oh. Can you uh, mix the beans too real quick? Sure. Actually, I'll do it. I'll do it. I got it. I'm going to add a little more liquid. I'm using bone broth just to make it really luscious here. And then we'll check it for seasoning. Probably want to mash it some more. And then a little squeeze of lime at the end. We'll add some good acid to cut through all that richness from the beans.
Now we're mixing up that Insta Fuel. We're good to go. Too young for water. Ah. Oh, someone says Wayne says there is H2O in those waters, in those coconuts. Mm. Uh, Siete doesn't have keto tortillas, but I've heard that Maria and Ricardo does now also. Where's the coffee? Oh. Conflicting reports if there's water in there. Well, we, were tr we, we found one over there and it was kind of hollow, kind of light. Yeah. We tried to crack it open. It was just soft. Yeah. Soft and we couldn't crack it It was it pretty open. old too. Uh, K Magura, $5. Uh, you'll occasionally eat paleo or are you strictly keto? Can I occasionally eat a Siete burrito even if I'm trying to be keto? So we do keto, paleo, but sometimes even we'll have brown rice or red lentil pasta. If you're trying to be keto, no, you can't have Siete. There's so many carbs in here. It would put you over your daily allotment. But if you're on keto and you get to a certain point after a while, you can transition to uh, paleo. Once your numbers come down, once your weight comes down, once your blood sugars come down. But no, you can't have that. Yeah, Ingrid, the Frontera is amazing. Cheers, guys. Nice. Mmm, cafe mocha, so good. And then the best. So you're not going to get that at Starbucks. Even if you did get it at Starbucks, it'd be way more expensive than doing it at home. But that is made with the coconut milk powder, organic cacao, reishi mushrooms, coconut sugar, um, virgin coconut oil. It has the MCTs. That's amazing. InstaFuel is the bomb. Are you throwing your food? That's her new thing now. She's throwing food on the floor. If you're done. Rose. Are you all done? Oh, 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 oh. Good. You're done. You're done. You're all done. Hold on. Shall we call mom so she can watch her? She's, she's gonna. I don't We're know. almost done here. She'll right? kind of freak out. Yeah, I just gotta make some burritos now. The beasts uh, look a little, um, a little loose. Oh, they're gonna keep cooking for a, a minute. So I just added. Uh... Okay. No, they're actually pretty good. Just gotta check it for seasoning. You wanna go outside and see Baba Dani? Okay. You want with mom? Okay. No, we're not going to do breakfast that often. It just happened this weekend that it worked out pretty well. Cheers, everyone. A little coffee. Ah, Rose and I and Desi had a tough night last night. Rose woke up multiple uh, times last no, night. No, no, last night, no. Last night, Bobby oh, came good. to bed very late. And Rose woke up convulsive for a while. But... Tough, but tough after night. The, after that, she slept. That was pretty tough. That's why I go, I go to bed early. You can use powdered goat milk for coffee, absolutely. Um, my, my la you know what, just uh, search Flay City Laird Superfood on, on uh, YouTube and you'll see a promo link in any video. Uh, Spice Store is uh, closed today. I'll go on Monday, tomorrow. That's uh, yesterday I got a recommendation for uh, the Spice Lab here in Pompano and I'm out of spices so I'm gonna go there. And uh, I need, you know, we're low on spices. I need a local place to buy uh, spices by the ounce or two. And there's a place here in Fort La, in Pompano that had that. And uh, yeah, that's great to have those local shops. But where we're at, there's so many stores. There's Aldi, Costco, Whole Foods, Publix, uh, even more. And Sam's Club is like 15 minutes away. I got a membership there finally. Sam's Club had a deal where if you get a membership online, They'll give you a forty-five dollar um, store credit, so it was a free membership. It was amazing. Yeah, Rose is either growing or teething, one of the two. Uh, the brand for the salsa is Frontera, but this one specifically, the double roasted tomato salsa. I wish the tomatoes were organic, but the ingredients are stellar. Really, really good. Okay, we're just about ready to make burritos. Eggs are done. Refried beans are done. I got the burrito wrappers I'm gonna warm in my massive uh, stove cast iron pan there. And then we'll grate some cheese. And we're gonna create a cheese shell on the outside of the burritos. And then we'll cut some uh, avocados too. And that's it. Let's check the uh, beans for seasoning. They're gonna need salt or lime juice. Let's see. Oh, nice, Ken says his sister lives near us. Love it. Mmm. Well, aggressively seasoned with the spices. That's really nice. That's done. Let's turn the okay. heat down, make sure the texture is right. 
Man, I can't get over how good oh. this is, you guys. It's cafe mocha. Rest a little bit. Rest a little wow. bit. Wow. Because look at the ingredients of the hot cocoa. Absolutely phenomenal. Yeah, coconut milk powder, cacao, coconut sugar, paleo sweetener, and mushrooms. I mean, come on, extra virgin coconut oil. Amazing. Oh, okay. What's going on out there? You're going to make some burritos now? Yeah. Okay. Rose is attached to mommy. Let me uh, warm these uh, tortillas here in the pan. Very low heat there. Ooh, tough customer out there. She won't stay out there with the grandma? No. Uh-uh. She's getting tired. She wants attention. Mm. How do you recommend we uh, build the burritos? I don't know. Huh. I have no recommendation. Hmm. I recommend I need a sip of coffee. <laughs> Let's go build the burritos. Oh, you want to with Baba? Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm trying, Viviana. Mamo glede yan. I want to make some burritos here. Come on, girls. What do you recommend here, Mom? What do you recommend? Just do it, man. Just do it. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to be tethered on this thing. Though. Okay, let's do this. Hold on. Hold the horses, Rosie. Hold the horses. Okay. Hold on, Rosie. Rose, are you on camera? Hold your horses, Rose. Mm. Hold your horses, Oh, Rose. I need some coffee, guys. <laughs> it's getting really hot in this kitchen. Rose, come here. All right, come here. Come on, let's do it. Come on. Okay, ready? We're going to build some burritos now. Okay. Get this pan hot. The first time I made these burritos with you guys on live, I put them directly on the burner. That was a mistake. They heated unevenly and they kind of broke when I rolled them uh, out. Doing them in a pan is the way to go. In probably Mexico, you would use like a cast iron comal and uh, that would be nice. What's up? You can just give her this for a second. Oh, one second, yeah. But um, any kind of big pan, the thing is you'll see these wrappers are huge. So you have to use like a 13 inch pan here. One Rose second. is crying because the carb count is too high. <laughs> oh, look at these tortillas. Huge, wow, right? look at that. beautiful. So now we're just going to warm them. I'm going to put you right here, Rose. Oh, you're caught on daddy's microphone. There we go. Wow, one, uh, 2.1. Uh... Well, that's a record. Ah, that's a record. 2.1 thousand on breakfast with Bobby. How about that? That's exciting. Okay, here's what we're going to do. <laughs> Rosie. This is the very few times we will allow Rose. Yeah, that almost a little never bit of happens. This never, this never happens. Nobody Just for the last five minutes of the live stream, we had a hang in there. Nobody tell anyone, please. Yeah, nobody tell anyone. Okay. So we have that, we have that. Let's get we everything. have moved from Chicago down to Florida. <laughs> like, people keep saying, like, wait, is this a new house? Did you yeah, move? Are, you, are you moving? There's a, I there's a question. A are you moving? FAQs. Can you do an FAQ section in there? FAQ section down in the description box. Where did Bobby and Desi meet? Where is Art? Where is Johnny? Have you moved? Yes. Where are you now? Is this your house? Is this your dream kitchen? We should have. No, it's a great rental house and a great rental kitchen, but no, it's not our Why dream. am I seeing everything blurry? That, that's not on us. You got to check your settings because my thing's coming through perfect right here. Don't worry. We've never given Rose Tylenol. Tylenol? God, no. Rose, please be careful because the floor is tired. Actually, what should parents give their, in your opinion, babies or toddlers if they do have a fever? I have given her just uh, some uh, suppositories once or twice when she had 
high temperature, but that was it. Not Tylenol. Stuff it up. And babies. Butt. <laughs> oh, you made a great one. This is so good. Just under oh, a quarter it's great, cup right? each wow. of the it's, fuel. It's also the ratio of like, uh, like that to, to uh, water. It's <laughs> aren't allowed out of the attic yet. <laughs> Uh, no, Art's locked in there still. Art is saying he's rocketing, he's not leaving. <laughs> ah, see, this is getting nice and soft now. I need one of those presses like they have at uh, Chipotle. So I'll put it with beans. <laughs> the mood has changed, see? Let's hurry up with that burrito. I don't <laughs> want too much uh, screen time for Yeah, us. I know. Uh, just when I'm missing it. Should I put cheese inside and outside or just on the crust outside, I think? I was going to uh, buy some cheese. At least too. one side, Bevel. Yeah, but not inside, right? I came to the uh, U.S. from Bulgaria when I Eggs. was 20 years old, right after high school. I came to college to, in the Chicagoland area. I got my bachelor's and master's. I had a great time. Loved being uh, in the States and studying here. Uh, and then moved to the city of Chicago, found a job. And a few years later, met Bobby. And the rest is history. The rest is still being made. History is being made. Put a little bit of cheese inside. Oh, no, I don't want inside, just inside, outside. Okay. Here, brother. Snack on some cheese. Jorge, I know. I'm looking forward to meeting your wife. That's from Bulgaria. Okay. So, nice and Are pliable. you guys down here somewhere? Boca, Check it out, Fort, Fort Lauderdale? Uh, 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 hold on. Look what daddy's going to do, babe. Okay, so, a little bit of beans go down. Can't overstuff the burrito. I learned that the hard way. A little bit of eggs. Yeah, we are in Pampano Beach, just south of Boca Raton. Go down. Are we north of uh, Fort Lauderdale? Yes. North of Fort Lauderdale. Little bit of avocado. There's an upcharge for that. You okay with that, Desi? Jorge's in West Palm Beach. Awesome, oh, nice. you guys. Yeah, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna hang Not out. Not too far away. Lots yeah. of sour cream inside. That's a yes. Hello from Romania. Oh, nice, Romania. The the town that's used for what butter is does Romania. Rose eat. What? Yeah, uh, Rose eats sometimes the uh, Kerrygold butter or just any butter that's 100% grass fed. Cultured butter from Organic Valley sometimes. And cultured butter, yeah. Okay, so here's what we're going to do we take it here, pull it back, one side comes in, other side comes in, we flip one more time, boom, burrito's done. Now, we take it in the pan. Look, the pan's still hot here. I take a little shot of avocado oil. Can we do Passover together? <laughs> I don't know if that meal would be very exciting. <laughs> you want to have the parsley and the bones? So, I really like to griddle my burrito oh, to get yeah, some texture good, and man. then do something really cool to add even more flavor and texture up with the cheese topping. Bro, was careful with my phone. If she breaks my phone, I'm going to freak out, babe. Why would she break it? Because she's going to drop it on that glass. Yeah. On the Don't drop the phone, Rocky. Keep the phone on the counter, man. Keep the phone on the counter, okay? Keep the phone on the counter. Yes, love. Okay, first I'll put it seam side down no, here. Here on the counter, yeah. Keep it on the on the table. And I'll get some nice crust and seal it closed. Babe, she's what? daring me now. What can I have? Mommy's phone. And keep it up there. Keep it up there, please. Yeah, keep it there. Wow, what a rascal. It's gonna break. Yeah. If you, it's gonna break. If it breaks, Rose, no one gets if to use it If you put anymore. it down, it's gonna break. And then, bad news. <laughs> no phone anymore. No more. <laughs> uh huh. Someone's saying terrible tools already. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be interesting, yeah, you guys, yeah. We use the booze block cutting board. Mm hmm. That's on my Amazon shop page too. We love Indian food when it's made properly. Yeah, I just don't cook it because I, I don't think I can do it properly. I do a couple dishes. Like in the new cookbook, we do a legit five ingredient Indian lentil curry. And I use Bobby approved store-bought flavor bombs. So look at this recipe here. Ooh, I see snacking on the- uh... We love ghee. Rose, careful with that please. So this, lentil curry stew, five ingredient here. And this is why it's so good. I use the Thai Kitchen's red curry paste and in this is chilies, ginger, galangal, lemongrass. That combined with mirepoix, 
uh, red split lentils, bone broth is a must, and kale, really, really good. So this is in the, uh, all, it's all about that broth chapter. But remember, every recipe in the book is super easy. It's five ingredients, all my shopping knowledge is in there. But they all have photos and macros, so you know exactly what you're putting in your body and all my shopping tips to tell you what to look for and buy. So definitely grab that on Amazon. Uh, you guys have been loving it. You want to give that to Mommy now? Yeah, Rose is funny. Oh, thank you, love. Yeah, for Mommy. Thank you, love. <gasps> thank you. You're so sweet. Thanks for taking good care of it. Thank you, Rosie. You're a sweetheart. Not quite yet. All right. How's the cheese, Rose? Yeah, try some cheese. I figure we'll just do one now, that way we can get it done, try it, and then make the other ones. Otherwise, we gotta wait a long Actually, it wouldn't have been that bad to be. I could have done them all at the same time. Yes, though. baby, undivided attention. That's what they want at all times. That is correct. 2.2. .2. Setting records in Florida. The last three live streams have been the most watched ever. Celebrate right. good times. Come on. Just so uh, you guys know, uh, we never give Rose a phone, so don't worry about that. This was an extreme, no, 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 extreme no, no, no. situation when we have to scramble, literally uh, and literally, <laughs> yeah, uh, the eggs and make this burrito and get this live stream for you. Otherwise, I would never give her a phone. She no. has lots of books in her bookshelf and her toy shelf. She yep. has lots of Montessori toys and she has her own kitchen and everything. It's just, it's very hard for her to nice be independent her and on her own for extended periods of time. She wants to be around us and near us and... Um, she never sees TV, never sees the iPad. Ne no, never. She actually never sees the phone. She used to see the phone when we did uh, FaceTime with Baba Donnie. Yeah, now but, she's here, but grandma, grandma is here, so we don't do FaceTime anymore. The only time she sees it, when I do Instagram stories, she'll run from the other side of the house to do it, but besides that... What is the, what is the type of mangoes we have? We actually uh, have to ask Chris, he would know better. Yeah. No, he told me, but I'll ask him again. One is a Kent. Kent. And the other two is an, an Indian something, and I don't know. Oh, we gotta, we gotta ask him again. He's coming over today. Yeah, He's actually the, the person who planted the trees back in the day when he was a young child. Used to live in this house. Now he lives nearby, and he came here to help us out with a few things around the house. So Look we're very... Uh, oh my God, this is gonna be so really nice. Now, here's the kicker. Take the cheese, put it in the pan like this. Rose, gentle, please, with my phone. Gentle. Rose, gentle, please, with gentle, my phone. Gentle, gentle. Take Rose, the please, cheese. Rose, please, gentle. <laughs> Rose, for mommy. Let the cheese Can melt. Can I have it? Give it to mommy, Rose. Here. Can I have it? Thank you, love. Thanks for taking care of it. <laughs> wow. This Do is you a... want your phone, Mish? Do you want your phone? This should, we should rename this. Uh... Oh, yeah, where's her phone? It's under there on the shelf. This is her phone, you'll see. Okay. Yeah, mama. One second, I'm just doing this Let real me quick. See. Yeah, all right here. Here's her little shelf. Lots of toys here. Okay, Rose. I got your phone. You want to call somebody? <laughs> your friends? Let's call some friends. Go outside. Yeah. Hello. So, Desi, I put the cheddar cheese in there. Kerrygold Dubliner from Costco. It oh. melted. I put the burrito directly Whoa, in there. Whoa, more? It's going to be a crown or something? Yeah. No, it's crusted. It's, it's, it's got it's a crust on it. Wow. It's got a cheese crust. And then Man, when it that's when it epic, babe. Oh, it's gonna be epic. I need another coffee, it's so epic. <laughs> yeah, come here. Oh, bum ba da ba Hey, Rose Honey Bunny. Huh? Richard, we don't have to justify our parenting style to you guys. I know you guys, but... Oh, it's good to you, explain. Some of you not, guys know us and some of you don't, so we're just sharing. Good point. We share everything, Richie boy. Thank you. Of course she wants the real deal phone, but we're giving her this one because there's no Do you screen give Rose on any it. vitamins? No, I don't. Um, there's actually a couple of things that I may consider giving, but since we moved down to Florida, there's lots of sun here. So no vitamin D, she doesn't need sure. that. I don't need, I don't give her any vitamins because nutrition is key. Uh, vitamins are just to fill in the gaps. So if you're in the northern cl climates, you don't have that much sun, maybe consider giving some vitamin D. Um, Finley, thank you, Finley. Eastern time zone, great point. Yeah, nutrition is key, you guys. What if was you, the probiotic it, you gave her when she was a baby? Uh, yeah, there was a, the little probiotic uh, I started giving around eight to 10 months. 
Gotta because she, who her Gotta tummy was still adjusting to all the uh, solids we were given. Uh, <laughs> so maybe a little probiotic, but um, that's about it. Look at the burrito rest. Yeah, it's really important to give nutrient-dense food to uh, the little ones and to yourself. Uh, <laughs> they're going after my microphone. I'll, I'll let it, leave it there, leave it there. So Bobby has a whole video, actually two videos on vitamins and supplements on YouTube. So check that out. Careful, uh, go careful. on YouTube and careful. do Flav City Vitamins. Careful, careful, check careful. Check that out, careful. lots of recommendations there. And also on Instagram, he constantly recommends different supplements and vitamins. And like, for example, um, right, check it out. the Real probiotics quick. are really cool, the ones he's using these days. See how it got crusty right around here? You just scrape up the side of the crust here. One second, Roasty. I'm almost done. Ooh, hot. Very hot. Should have had a touch more oil in here. Yeah, Rosie's the snacking you chef. Know, I'm gonna switch to something else real quick. Excuse me, Rose. Daddy is frantically uh -huh. looking for another spatula. There we go. There we go. See, it's all about having the right tool. Hey, look, look at this, Desi. Boom. You get the nice crust of cheese on there. Tiffany, can you give me your question again? I didn't see it, there's so many comments, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> see, get that nice crust of cheese wow, on there. Wow, it's gonna be nice super, and super yummy. Crispy. It's gotta cool down for a minute though, it's very, very hot. In the meantime, I can make another burrito. Mm -hmm. It's hot. It's hot, Rosie. See, this pan, once again, it got very, very hot. Ooh, hot. Hot. Hachi mama. Hachi mama, Rose. Yeah, the Veronica, $9.99. Hi, guys. Just received my Flake City tea yesterday, and I'm already in love. I've always been making my way through the Rose. five ingredient <laughs> cookbook. I love feeling. I paint you with buy approved items. Thank you. Amazing. Come. Thank you so much. Why is Rose crying? Because she's been on the live stream for 62 minutes already. She's antsy pantsy. She wants our attention. She's been antsy pantsy all morning, to be fair. This is normal behavior for a 19 month old man. When you see the three minute Rose videos, you're like, oh, she's an angel. And she usually she's is. She's definitely probably teasing. Yeah, there's some teeth still coming out. Yeah, this is real. This is real life. Put this guy in there. The size of the collagen bag. How big is that collagen bag? Um, 20 ounces. Tiffany. Okay, Tiffany, I see your question. Would you do Valentine's Day treats or breakfast waffles? And what kind of food coloring do you use? Okay, food coloring. So you got to be very careful with food coloring. Nothing that contains those nasty... Uh, artificial, ones. artificial ones where it says red number two yeah. yellow number five you know you got to stay away that's toxic like that's poisonous one, right so you got to find something natural or make your own with beets like for example if you want something for valentine's day uh i remember we made back in the day these beet uh pancakes oh yeah so just do something natural with natural foods and stuff like that i mean that not all everything has to be always so colorful or like you know blueberries blueberries are so great for color if you see my cookbook in our cookbook uh here in the dessert section i have this blueberry panna cotta and it's i mean it's look at the color look at this color have you seen a color like that it's gorgeous all the colors you can find in nature so Go oh, yeah, let's for cut this natural. burrito. There you go, sweet. Put some avocado. What do you want? What do you want, mommy? Or do you want butter? A little butter? Mommy? Okay, here. Sit on mommy's lap while daddy finishes. For Valentine's Day, like you were asking for desserts, I'm going to do this shortbread oh, yeah. heart-shaped chocolate 
<laughs> cookies dipped in chocolate. Right. So stay tuned for that. We're gonna make them with Rosie this week. So, pull your chair out. Rose wants to sit in your lap for a second. Okay, Rose. There you go. Come with me, my love. There Up you la. go. Rose, yeah, you can look at the book. There you go. Yes, love. Ooh, right. I should have put some shorts on. Okay, check this out real quick, Desi. So if I cut this in half. Wow, babe. Oh my goodness. See, look, we got this with the cheese crust on there. Oh, Melted cheese cow, inside. that looks good. Show it again. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Oh man, it's gonna be so good. So I would finish this with a little shtickle of salsa right there. Yum, yum. Let's eat. Let's eat. Oh my God. How good is that, babe? Mm -hmm. And Ooh, for mommy, yes. Crispy. How's the cheese crust? Season perfectly. Mm. That's a dinner. Yeah, that could be a dinner. Actually, Bobby made dinner burritos one time. Mm. Mm. Yum, yum. Wow. Let's give some to Rose in a second, yes? It's very hot, Rose. Want to try a bite or wait? Want to try a bite, babe? I do, but I can't. Oh, okay. Wow. I have my hands full. One with rose, one with the camera. Oh my god. The flavor's off the charts. We used organic beans from Whole Foods. Mm -hmm. Any organic canned beans, if you want to soak and make your own, that works too. That is delicious. Oh, got to chase with some coffee. Any left or no? Uh, yeah, she could be thirsty, she could be hungry, she could be just wanting to sit with me, wanting maybe some milk. She always uh, mm -hmm. just wants to be around us, near us. Holding her, <laughs> Rose is chowing down. <laughs> this one's for Baba Danny, Mama. Let's Ma leave it here for Dan so he can make the burrito. Look, wow. Danny. This you give to Daddy? Absolutely sensation. Can I have that, Rosie? Yeah. I'm gonna make that for Grandma. <laughs> Baba. Baba. Mm. Oh, babe, the crunch of the charts. Oh my God. The yeah, cheese we put on the, on the outside. Touch on the inside for this one. A touch on the inside. But you have to warm the tortillas in a flat-bottomed pan. I don't care if it's. Ceramic, um, steel, cast iron's best because it really makes it pliable. Yes, this video is live right now. <laughs> <laughs> it better be. It better be um, live. If you can't fast forward, then it's live. <laughs> mm. Wow. So, we did it. Hour and five minutes. It takes a lot quicker when you're not messing around. But that's it. Yeah, Granway's staying indefinitely at this point. She just came uh, five one, days ago. One way so ticket, baby. We're not even talking about her leaving anytime soon. So we'll see. She's very excited. Uh, she loves the house. I mean, she loves the house because her house also has a garden and lots of outdoor space. And uh, she's so, so excited. I mean, imagine. Imagine yeah, it's right, winter yeah. right now in Bulgaria. It's cold, so she can't do anything, but now she's here. She's planting the garden. One of her She wants to try the burrito, babe. Just give her some burrito. The burrito wrapper? The burrito oh, you the made. the actual burrito? Oh, here. Where's her little plate? Over there. Here, Rosie. Hi. Try this. Here's, here's the burrito. So what, my, my thinking is she'll stay, and then months will go by. It'll be time to move into the new place. She'll stay for that. Might as well stay for Christmas then. But she won't go until January 2022. I got to tell you this, guys. So my dad, uh, my dad uh, talked to her the other day and he said, Danny, uh, don't worry. Just stay there with the kids. Uh, if you don't mind just coming back here to plant the garden and then go back again. <laughs> so I'm like, what do you think? Mom is a seasonal worker. She's gonna <laughs> just go back for planting the garden. Seasonal so, worker. Yeah. Uh, we'll see, we'll see uh, what happens. Maybe we'll just get my dad over here too and that's it. <laughs> uh, but my dad, my dad gets very antsy. He yeah. needs his friends, he, he needs his... Uh, we just finished one burrito. This is unbelievable. And there's a cheese crust on here that I put on. So burrito's wrapped. I'm griddling it in a hot cast iron pan to get some nice color on each side. But what I'll do next creates the cheese crust. So hang on a sec. Your dad wouldn't be able to chill here the way that... Uh, the thing is, he will love it for a week, and then he's like, okay, I need my... Yeah, his routine. My buddies, uh, he likes to visit his friends around, he likes to sit down, have a, have coffee, or have a drink with them, so... Yep. Um, he, yeah, in, in two weeks, he'll be like, okay, I'm ready to go back. <laughs> <laughs> my mom, on the other hand, she can stay forever. She loves being around us, helping us, 
And now with this outdoor space oh, and this beautiful uh, weather, she's definitely, she's in heaven. She's never been actually in a tropical climate before. She's really enjoying all the plants, the trees, the variety uh, of, of vegetation here. And uh, today we're going to the beach, so it's going right. to be really fun. Uh-huh. Absolutely. Yeah, my dad is a man of the people. <laughs> That's right. Bring dad to the States. Yeah, he's been here a few times. But he's only been in Chicago, you guys, so it's very different here. All right, cheddar cheese goes down. Once it looks like that, take the burrito and just plop it right there. Wait three or four minutes. It's going to stick and create a crust. The edges will get crispy. Then we'll lift it off and it has the most beautiful burrito crust. All right. Ask Rose anything. Hashtag. What you guys want to know? Ask Rose anything. Rose, what's your favorite toy? Mm. Mommy's phone. Okay. Rose, I'll what's your favorite out. food? Anything that Daddy makes. Rose, <laughs> who's your favorite? You can leave that thing. Yeah. Try it, bye. Okay. Oh, me? Whoa, Rose, mm -hmm. look at that. You want to try first? Okay, go ahead. Mm -hmm. Mommy? Oh, it's so sweetie, Rose. Mm. The crunch. Mm. Wow, babe. This is unbelievable. It's a Kerry Gold Dubliner. This is unbelievable. Thank you. The flavor is just on point, right? Wow, on point, Bebo. Mm. Creamy eggs. Uh-huh. Yummy mm, beans. And it needs the texture from the crust because everything is soft. We need the crust, yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Beans are soft, eggs are soft, tortilla soft. But with the cheese crust, the crunchification is exactly what the body needs. So yummy. Mm. So good, Ben. Wow. Thank you. Amazing. I think my mom's going to love it, too. <coughs> yeah. I might have to make more uh, scrambled eggs. Which is no, deep. I think that's enough. That's enough? Okay. They're pretty filling. All right, guys. Exactly what you want to eat before you go to the beach. <laughs> Let me just finish one more to Whoa. see how it looks like. I got it. Where am I? This is real life, baby. Mm -hmm. We're, not We're using Kerrygold, uh, almost 100% grass-fed. The Dubliner. We should just use 100% grass-fed, babe. Um, yeah, I just didn't have a chance to buy that from Whole Foods. The Organic Valley grass-fed. Mm. It's expensive, but it's really wow. good. But I have the Dubliner. Where did Rose get her dishes and her plates and cups at? Mm. Go to Amazon.com slash shop. Nope. It's down in the description box. If you go in the description Mama. box, Desi's Amazon shop page for Rose Mama. is down there. Mama. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mama. But Everything on my Amazon shop page. But, little plates, little um, cups, but, everything for her. But, right, of course Rose but, misses, misses art. She loves art, Uncle Art, right, Mimi? So the cheese trick will work on any pan. Any pan. Thank you, Viviana. I think uh, Rose wants to go to see Baba. Oh. Well, I got to I gotta eat this bread. So good. Rose is 19 months old. 19 uh -uh. months. Oh, careful. She's wandered out there alone, babe. She did? Yeah. Why is the door open? I don't know. Come inside, Rose. I got to get that thing out of the pan. All right. Hold on. I got it. You get with Rose real quick. Yeah. Oh, babe. I... How would I go outside, <laughs> babe? Come, come on. Come. Just come back inside. Okay. Come back inside. There's Rose. There's Rose. Shall we sit out here a little bit? Baba. Oh, where's Baba? I think she's in the back planting something. She's around the corner with the potted plants. All right, guys. I think that's it for today. We'll say bye-bye from everybody. One second. I just got to do one more little flip here. All right. Look at this. You take it like this. The cheese gets attached to the burrito and then boom. Look at this, you have a cheese crust that give it 30 seconds. It'll get super duper hard and add a nice crunch to the burrito. Okay. All right, bye guys. Okay. Woo, that was exciting. Bye everyone, we'll see you next week. I don't know the schedule yet. Rose is saying goodbye too. Awesome time hanging out. We gotta eat clean and go to the beach.